Hello there, comic book fans. Uh, yours truly back with another stack of new additions. Uh, keeping with the Charlton main that I've been on lately. Uh, some very cool books uh, that I picked up. Uh, very late Golden Age, early Silver Age Charlton. Uh, and as you can see, just so many different titles here. Obviously, the Ghost Manor, uh, they'll be covered in another uh, video. But I wanted to show you some of these, these really cool titles here. Uh, public Defender in Action. Uh, nothing says action like court to me. Um, but uh, I'm kind of making fun of the title here. But uh, uh, just love getting books like this. Again, 1957. It's in pretty good shape here too. Uh, for Especially for a reader assortment that I just picked up. So uh, continuing, we have uh, Nyoka. Uh, Nyoka. Nyoka? 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 That's harder to say than uh, than I thought. Uh, yeah, well, she's the jungle girl. And uh, I don't speak jungle, I guess. So, and she's wrestling a cool shark. Great, great cover on that one. Uh, here we're getting into some uh, some of the good stuff that made me uh, made me pull the trigger on this lot. Uh, Diko Conga here, A Monster's Dream. Uh, I did notice the two strategically, conspicuously placed uh, <laughs> uh, missile hits there on uh, the gorilla, which, you know, from a... A far newsstand would be a rather provocative cover. Uh, I, don't, I don't put anything past these creators. Uh, we have an issue of Gorgo here. Very, very cool. I have a reprint collection of Gorgo, but these are actually my first uh, single issues. So very, very cool. This is, this is what made me pull the trigger on this lot. This is a 64-page giant Steve Ditko Conga Gorgo. Fantastic Giants, regular 25 cents, kids. Of great monster action. I can't wait to dive into this. I'm a big Ditko guy. I think as every comic book fan really should be. If you're not already. Again, continuing. Sarge Steel. Looks like a cop drama. Sarge Steel, private detective. A cool knowing man who savors danger. Alright, I'm in. <laughs> so very cool. This is, this is, again, maybe... Just, you know, epitomizing anything that was kind of in vogue in the day. This is a book on hot rods. This is a 10 center from uh, probably about 57 again, I would guess. Yeah, there it is, 57. So continuing, we got some more hot rod racers. These are great books. Don't have anything like this in my collection. Okay, now, now we're into the 12 centers here. Later day, uh, are still 12 cent actually. You're getting more modern though, I think, with the design here. We have another uh, different kind of racing book. We have Grand Prix here. Another one, Dragon Wheels. It's a very cool looking book here. The Peacemaker, 12 center number four, and this has the origin of the Peacemaker. So, don't know anything about this character at all. So. Again, that's kind of the fun with me for Charlton. They have so many different titles, and I'm just uh, loving getting these like reader assortments for not a lot of money either. You know, uh, a couple bucks a piece. Uh, so Captain Adam, <clears throat> of course, more well, more uh, more well-known property uh, with Ditko. Another ca great Captain Action. Captain Adam, sorry. It's a great cover here too. Uh, for some reason, there's two, there's two issues of it, uh, but it's Thunderbolt, Peter Cannon Thunderbolt. I mean, just look at how that pops. Really looks Golden Age as opposed to even Silver Age, that cover, you know? Love it. And uh, a couple more here. We have a Judo Master, another, you know, uh, title, whatever, whatever was kind of hot. Uh, this would have been, let's see. What's the date on here? Uh, 66. So it actually predates the uh, the Kung Fu craze. So Charlton was a little ahead of the, ahead of the curve, really, on this one. But, uh, it's a great cover here. Well, this one's for Pop. Judo Master. Great cover. A couple more here. We have a uh, issue, always cool to add, uh, an issue of the Phantom. I have a few of these. It's probably the one Charlton title that uh, I actually have purchased over the years uh, actively. I uh, just love the Phantom. And last but not least, and they threw in an issue of Snuffy Smith. 
So hey, I hope you dug these Charlton's. I hope you like comics and uh, leave me a comment down below. Let's uh, get the uh, conversation going. And thanks for watching this video. Like and subscribe and all that jazz. Later.